Ezekiel Elliott last year with New England, 184 rush attempts, 642 yards, three rushing touchdowns, 51 receptions on 65 targets, 313 yards, and two touchdowns through the air. Thoughts on Zeke? I don't feel like New England used Zeke the right way, right? And and yes, I understand why Dallas had to let him go at the end of the 22 season and cap reasons and everything else. But I, I'm glad he's back because I think they I think they just understand how to use him a bit better. Um, his total touches between 22 and 23 were still – they were almost identical, about 260. But I do think we see a bounce back, right? Like I think there's no way he's going – um, he will not finish outside of running back three, right? So if he's inside the top 36, he is the lead back in Dallas. He is going to see the goal line work. And if you're doing a zero RB or hero RB type draft strategy, this is a guy that you need to target. Run plays got to go somewhere in Dallas, right? They're not going to be 100% pass. So the run, the, the ball has to get handed off to somebody. It's more often than not going to be Zeke. So give me a lead back in an offense uh, at pick 120. Yeah, I'll take I will hit draft and not think twice. There's no, there's no way that if Zeke is healthy all year that he does not, does not finish in, in at least RB three territory. Right. Not going to surprise me if we look up at the end of the season and we see him somewhere in the, 170 to 180 rush attempts um, when this thing's all said and done and probably somewhere around the 650 to 700 yard range and five touchdowns, um, at least on the ground, right? Like I think all of those things are very, very plausible here. Uh, Zeke certainly does get uh, work through the air as well, right? Like not going to surprise me if we see, Ze uh, we look up and we see Zeke have, um, you know, probably in that, 30 to 40 range on receptions with another 200 yards to the air and one or two touchdowns. Like I think that there's a lot of opportunity here. And for a guy that you're drafting way late, um, you, this is a guy that could sneak up into, um, you know, upper end RB three territory.